evening, ladies and gentlemen. This book is Dog Breath, The Horrible Trouble with Halitosis, written by Dave Pilkey. It is one of my favorite books, and I want to share it with you this evening. Okay, so here's the title page. Dog Breath, The Horrible Trouble with Halitosis. There was once a dog named Halley who lived with the Tosis family. Hallie Tosis was a very good dog, but she had a big problem. Hallie Tosis had horrible breath. Whenever Hallie Tosis opened her mouth, horrible things happened. You can see the wallpaper peeling off the wall. The leaves are falling off the plant. Poor goldfish is upside down. And the Mona Lisa is holding her nose. When the children took Halitosis for a walk, everyone else walked on the other side of the street. Even skunks avoided Halitosis. But the real trouble started one day when Grandma Tosis stopped by for a cup of tea and Hallie jumped up to say hello. Mr. and Mrs. Tosis were not amused. Something has to be done about that smelly dog, they said. The next day, Mr. and Mrs. Tosis decided to find a new home for Hallie. Free dog to a good home. The children knew that the only way they could save their dog was to get rid of her bad breath. So they took Hallie Tosis to the top of a mountain that had a breathtaking view. They had hoped that the breathtaking view would take Hallie's breath away, but it didn't. Next, the children took Hallie Tosis to a very exciting movie. They had hoped that all the excitement would leave Hallie breathless. They took her to see Breath of a Salesman, starring Perry O'Donnell and Ginger Vitus. It said, it'll leave you breathless. But it didn't. Finally, the children took Hallie Tosis to a carnival. They hoped that Hallie would lose her breath on the speedy roller coaster. There they go. I don't think it worked. But that idea stunk too. The plans to change Hallie's bad breath had failed. Now only a miracle could save Hallie Tosis. Sadly, the three friends said goodnight, unaware that a miracle was just on the horizon. Later that night, when everyone was sound asleep, two sneaky burglars crept into the Tosis house. The two burglars were tiptoeing through the dark, quiet rooms when suddenly they came upon Hallie Tosis. Yikes, whispered one burglar. It's a big, mean, scary dog. Ah, don't be silly, whispered the other burglar. That's only a cute little fuzzy puppy. The two burglars giggled at the sight of such a friendly little dog. That dog couldn't hurt a fly, whispered one burglar. Come here, Poochie Poochie, whispered the other. So Hallie Tosis came over and gave the burglars a nice big kiss. Slurp. The next morning, the Tosis family awoke to find the two bur burglars passed out cold on their living room floor. It was a miracle. The Tosis family got a big reward for turning in the crooks, and soon Hallie Tosis was the most famous crime-fighting dog in the country. In the end, Mr. and Mrs. Tosis changed their minds about finding a new home for Hallie. They decided to keep their wonderful watchdog after all. This home protected by dog breath. Because life without halitosis just wouldn't make any sense. The end. We good?